and in your name done many wonderful works. And he says, but in that time I'll profess to them, I never knew you. Depart from me, you who work iniquity. So I'd like to pray and ask that um, we would understand that what the Lord, um, what he mean, is saying here, that we may understand is that those who are called to his marriage supper are those whom he's knowing, and that we we can know that um, we're his and that we belong to him and that um, we're his his bride, his wife, and that we're we're special, we're we're chosen. And um, I like to pray and ask that we can rejoice in in that. Thank God for His Word, yeah. and may God always give us a blessing by hearing His Word. Thank you. <laughs> yes. We'll pray. Thank you, dear God. I thank you for Your Word. It ministers to us and brings us on into the fullness of having what is your will. And so thank you that you've given us the scriptures. Thank you for the Bible. Thy word have I hid in my heart that I might not be wrong, that I might not sin, that I might be what you want me to be. So thank you for the Bible, but minister to us in our journey. Lead and guide us further than where we are. Help us in all of this moment. Bring us further, and we shall thank you. Yea, we come to thank you now. All right, and uh, phone number for the broadcast, 313-838-1035. And we've got some 15 minutes in the second hour, and then we've got 25 minutes after 2 in the morning, and then the message will begin. So we've got quite a bit of time for prayer still. Taking our next call, God bless, you're on the air. Uh, yes, Pastor Lord, I wonder if I might have the honor of giving the mailing address. I thank God for the honor of hearing your voice. Go right ahead. Thank you. If you've just tuned into this program, or if you are a long-standing member of the broadcast family, you are listening to Night Vision. Night Vision is a standalone, listener-supported prayer and testimony ministry. Night Vision comes to you as a live broadcast by nights each week and originates in Detroit, Michigan. You can reach Night Vision at area code 313-838-1035. Once again, that's area code 313-838-1035. One zero three five. If you'd like to play a part in guaranteeing Night Vision's future by making a donation, help pay for Night Vision's airtime expenses. You can make a check or money order payable to Night Vision. That's capital M I G H D, capital V S Victory I S I O N. That is one word. The check or money order made payable to Night Vision can then be mailed to Night Vision. Same name. Capital M I G H D, capital V is Victory, I S I O M, P O Box, 3 9 2 4 1, Detroit, Michigan, zip code 4 8 2 3 9. Once again, the mailing address is Night Vision, capital M I G H D. Capital V as in victory, I S I O N P O box three nine two four one Detroit, Michigan, zip code four eight two three nine. For those of you who have access to the internet, Night Vision's website can be found at 
www.pastormobile.com. Once again, that's www.pastor, B as in Bravo, O-G-L-E dot C-O-M. Through this website, you can make electronic donations to Night Vision by using your debit or credit card and clicking on Donate. You'll be redirected to PayPal, and you can use the secured site to make your donations to Night Vision. On Friday nights, you can also call Pastor Dave on his off-the-air prayer line. Pastor Dave can take the donations during that time. Thank you, Pastor. Well, bless you, sir. I will uh, speak with you again tomorrow. I'd like to ask you one thing. I won't start the message to 225. After we get through this hour, could you in the next time call one more time tonight? Well, certainly. What, uh, what time would you prefer? Well, I think uh, anywhere to... 15 uh, or b just before it, but uh, roughly 2.15. Yes, sir. I will uh, be happy to do that. I'll talk to you in uh, about a half an hour or so, then, 25 minutes. Oh, so, yes, hallelujah. I'll be, I'll be back in touch. So you have a wonderful evening, and I will, I will speak one more time to, uh, to you uh, for the uh, main address. God bless you so very, very, very much. Okay. And uh, I find God speaking to me about you. And I just want you to know any way that I can be a benefit to you, I want to be able to do what I can. God bless you. Thank you so much. But as you, as you should well know, just the privilege of being part of this broadcast is uh, more than I could ever ask or anticipate. So I'm tickled to death to be able to do that. And I appreciate your allowing me to, to be a part of the broadcast. So thank you so much. You've already uh, blessed me immensely, and I appreciate it. So I will talk to you uh, in just a little bit. And uh, how do you get your financial need covered well, I'm retired. Um, I'm, a, I'm, I'm a Social Security uh, recipient. I have Social Security, just like okay. most, most other folks do. Yeah, yeah. So you, got, so you got income that comes in? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> I'm glad. <laughs> but, you know, uh, I suppose all of us could uh, say that, too. But, no, uh the Lord has provided for me and uh, allowing me to be able to uh, be a beneficiary of the uh, Social Security program. And I've been uh, uh, receiving those payments for over well, almost six years now, I guess. So it's uh, been a, an enormous blessing, and I'm grateful uh, for what I've uh, been able to, to uh, receive from that uh, program. So, yep, that's, what, that's how it works. So. I'm so glad to hear that because in my spirit, I felt God telling me, if he has real trouble, you better help him. So I thank God that you're not doing real bad. Well, I'll tell you what, Pastor, if it turns out that I have real trouble, I'll be calling you, okay? You do that and I'll respond because... God spoke to me and said, I've blessed you, you be sure, and bless that one when he needs it. Well, gee whiz. Thank you so much, Pastor. And that sounds to me about something like God would say, so I receive it. I'll talk to you in a little bit. All right. Um, I just thank God for you. I do. We'll talk sure. one more time tonight. Yes, sir. Bye-bye. And thanking the Lord, taking our next call. God bless. You're on the air. That's cool. Yes. This is uh, truck driver Randy. I talked to you a year ago. 
Am I so glad to hear you because I haven't heard a truck driver as much as I usually do. And I thank God, truck driver, give us that name again. I want to write it down. Randy, R-A-N-D-Y. R-A-N-D-Y. It's your time. Go right ahead. Well, you've been blessing the marriages, and mine will be 30 years next Monday. Uh, the beautiful woman that I fell in love with in 1981. Beautiful. So if you could bless my marriage, I'd be very happy for that. And for my mother and my father also. And let's see, my mother is 81 and my father is 84. And where do you drive a truck at? In what area? In Michigan? Uh, yeah, I, I mostly stay in the state of Michigan. 